The quarterback is coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Second and two. He gets it again on this drive. Well, a short gain on the run that time by the offense. When you're running football team, listen, there's going to be a lot of ugly plays that don't work. You just got to keep running them. That last play was a run. Third down coming up. There's the tackle, but still, it's enough for the first down. Good run that time. It results in a first down, and it moves those chains on the sideline. Keep those chains moving. Tire that defense out. The quarterback has his team's attention here. First and ten. He'll throw it over the middle. Chargers get a first down. Another touchdown to increase the lead. Well, you got a lead. Now you're able to go out there and drive down the field and score a touchdown. This changes how the other team is going to manage the game from here on out. The point after try is in the books. The Cowboys are ready to run back this kick. This is a big time return. First down here. Quarterback drops back, play action. The quarterback throws the pass. Ball is batted down. They call that the moment of truth. It's a beautiful throw down the field, but the defensive back, he waits until it's time to make that jump. He defends the pass. What a good job by the defensive back. They bring in an extra defensive back. Second down and 10. Looking across the middle, the defense did not give up an inch. Well, my man had all day to throw that football that time. It was great protection by the offensive line. Just a horrible throw by him and uh, incompletion. Looks like they're in press coverage here. Following that incompletion, it sets up third and ten. Unbelievable grab. Zone defense doesn't work in the NFL like it used to. Good job by the quarterback reading that zone and finding the open guy. Defense respecting the deep ball, playing way off the receivers. Offense lines up here. Throwing now to his left. That catch will keep the drive alive. Steps out of bounds. You can't play zone coverage against this quarterback. He knows it's zone, and he's going to find the open throwing lane, and he gets it done. No bump coverage here. Corners backing up. Good job here by the quarterback. He doesn't like what he sees on the defensive side, so he is changing the play to the receivers by giving him hand signals. Or anytime you're in the red zone, you want to punch it in and get that touchdown. If they do that, look, they still, they're still going to be behind, but it gives them confidence moving forward. are going to meet the receivers right on the line of scrimmage. First down, following the long play. Quarterback taking the snap from the shotgun. The quarterback throws to the right. Going to lose yards here. This is where games are won and lost. Once an offense gets down the red zone, even though they're down more than seven, can you find a way to punch it in there for the touchdown and not settle for a field goal? Play number six coming up on this drive. Going across the middle. Knocked down. There's a difference. When you play zone, you drop back and you watch the quarterback and you react to the football. When you're playing man-to-man, -man, 
all you're worried about is where that receiver goes. You try to shadow him, look for the football, and try to make a play. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. That timeout by the offense. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Play action fake, looking to throw. That ball has been picked off. That was a terrible throw by the quarterback. When you're off target like that, you deserve to throw an interception. It's first down as they head to the line. Play action fake and dropping back the throw. And it's knocked down, incomplete. Well, the quarterback had all day long that time, and he just couldn't, he couldn't make the throw, so we got a little incompletion there. Defense calls a timeout. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. Out of the eye, they give it to the tailback. The margin is increased with another touchdown. Well, Jim, with that touchdown this late in the game, that ices it. And if you could sing, you could, uh, I'd let you say it's turn out the light, but we know you can't sing. So the game is over. Point after is good. Chargers getting set for the kickoff. He's going to be tackled right around the 21 yard line. Number 32. The Cowboys ready to take over the football. First down here. Drop back, shotgun formation. Kyle Orton unleashes. Interception. And he's brought to the ground. I, well, I have to say, that's just a terrible decision by the quarterback there. He's got to know when you're in a situation like this, you just cannot make that type of pass. The quarterback coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Now first and ten. Play action, trying to work the middle of the field. And they bring it down at the 36-yard line. You know, when that football was coming towards him in the air, he knew if he caught it, he was going to take a big hit. Well, you know what? Good thing he caught it, because if he'd have dropped it, he still was going to take a big hit. Nice catch by the receiver. After that grab, it's now second down and two. Here's the handoff to Ryan Grant. Number 26 hits the call of the run. Loss of two. Nickel formation here for the defense. Third and four. Play fake here, and he wants to throw it across the middle. Quarterbacks love play action passes because the defense, sometimes they're expecting run. You fake it, easy completion down the field. First down, offense readying for the snap. Ryan Grant carries the football. And 
there it is. 60 minutes has run off at long last, and this game is finally over. A blowout from the start. And coming up next is the post-game wrap-up brought to you by Gatorade. Recover 03 Series. Well, it's a big performance in front of a primetime audience and a sweet victory in the end. Of course, the players are not thinking about the fact that, hey, a lot of people are watching this here today in this game. But when you win, and then you sit back and think everybody was watching this and you played well, boy, that is some great experience. For Phil Sims and all the crew, Jim Nance saying so long.